My name is Dave Kanyak, and I am the Director of Facilities for the Barnstable Public Schools. I'd like to welcome you to the site of the new Barnstable High School Athletic Facility, future home of Red Raiders Athletics. We began construction on this site with a groundbreaking on May 8th of this year. We have an expected field completion date of November 11th, and we have expect to have full use of the facility for spring sports in 2020. The field's configured with new dugouts, uh, press box with a filming platform, restrooms, concession stand, and a patio. We expect to have parking for 100 cars. The stadium seating capacity will seat 400 people and will include things like uh, netting and a full multi-use scoreboard. The so left field will be 338 feet, center field will be 388 feet, and right field will be 321 feet. When completed, the fans can expect a real stadium experience. You'll enter the fields above and you will actually look down onto the field just as you would, you would uh, experience at any major league ballpark. And you'll have full view of, of the fields from all around. There'll be seating on the first base side and the third base side as well behind home plate. The viewing experience will be great. Again, the fields will be lit, so we'll be able to enjoy games at night. It will also be a multi-purpose field. We'll also have be able to hold soccer games and field hockey games on this field as well. Phase two will include the remainder of the fields surrounding this ball field. That includes all the grass, the, the varsity softball field, and uh, JV baseball field, and support fields behind. This will all be interconnected by paths, and we will have a, an athletic facility on this side, which will be very accessible from anywhere on the campus and easy to get from one field to another. Phase three will be on the other side of the street behind the tennis courts, and we'll do a similar improvement over there through the fields behind the intermediate school. Right here, there, right now we are excavating for the grandstands, and we're excavating down for the uh, footer foundation and, and where the grandstands will be placed. So here at this site, you see we're beginning to form up for the batter's box and home plate. As I mentioned earlier, the fields will be uh, synthetic turf, but the batter's box and home plate will have traditional clay infill so that the batters and catchers will, will have firm footing and, and the type of uh, base that they like to be on when, when digging in for batting. Here on, on the third baseline, we will we plan on uh, installing uh, two bullpens uh, and, and a batter's cage uh, for, for practice. And then on the first baseline, there will be a, a bullpen as well. So we're looking forward to completion of this project, uh, moving forward with the next two phases and, and being able to provide a, a, a division, division one, state-of-the-art, first-class facility for, for the families and students at Barnesville Public Schools.